live stream. And there we go. All right, good afternoon again. Welcome to Dew Point. Um, welcome to everyone who's tuned in around the country on our live stream. My name's Rob van der Bell. I'm one of the executives here. I'm going to be spending the next 45 minutes with you going through what this business is all about, who we are. And after the presentation, you're welcome to come speak to me, ask me any questions that you might still have. All right, so let's begin. As you can see, we're a division of a company called Constantia Insurance Company Limited. Constantia is a registered insurance company in South Africa. Uh, we were founded in 1952, so a very long time ago. Uh, we don't share offices with Constantia, but they're just down the road from us here in Randburg. The FSP number that we operate under is that one over there uh, in the foyer above the water cooler. You might have noticed we've got all these certificates up on the wall. Those are our financial services board licenses. So go take a look at those. We've got a license to operate in the long and short term space for insurance. We've got an investment license. We've got our financial services provider license. And we've also got our accreditation with the direct marketing and the direct selling association. So we take credibility very seriously. I imagine that uh, any of you that are considering joining this business need to trust the business. And so credibility is taken very seriously here. Uh, you're welcome to go do a background check on us. We're part of another company called Conduit Capital, which is listed on the Joburg Stock Exchange. Uh, the senior staff here at Dewpoint are these people up on screen, the managers and executives. So the first three people here are registered chartered accountants. That's very important, obviously. Um, Brendan Benfield's our senior executive. He's got a lot of experience in financial services, particularly in insurance, because he's, his family have been involved in insurance his entire life, because his father got involved in insurance straight out of school, pretty much. Uh, Dr. Brian Benfield is a professor of uh, insurance, a doctor of insurance. He taught at WITS for 25 years. He founded Clientel Life. Uh, he founded the IFA. Uh, and then Bren Brendan and his brother Stuart followed in their father's footsteps. And they went on to found a business down the road called Prime Meridian Direct or PMD, uh, which is the fourth biggest short-term insurance company in the country at the moment. So uh, we're very lucky to have Brendan heading up this division. Tim and Stacy, they look after the auditing, the regulatory, the financial aspects, accounting aspects of our business. Tim is, uh, comes from a corporate banking background. He was with the first RAND group for about 15 years where he was fairly senior there. Uh, Stacy has worked in uh, auditing all her career. Uh, she was with uh, Deloitte. Uh, she worked here as well as overseas um, before she came back to South Africa and joined the team. So those are the accountants. These two are the non-accountants. You can see they're not talking to us. Can you see the accountants are ignoring us? We, we're trying to understand what they're talking about. Um, so Jane is very experienced in network marketing or referral marketing. She's actually from the UK. She's been in South Africa for about a decade now, but she brings very important uh, expertise to our team because even though we're an insurance company, our growth is very much dependent on our ability to work in the network marketing space. And Jane brings that experience to our team. Myself, I've been working in advertising for over 20 years. I ran my own digital agency uh, for about 15 years. We operated heavily within the financial services space. So I'm not too, uh, I'm quite familiar with dealing with accountants and uh, working in the financial space. Uh, so that's our team. Uh, we obviously have client service support staff. We've got other admin staff, but the mandate of the staff here at Dewpoint. So the task given to staff of Dewpoint is to support everybody that joins us in this business. We want to see you as effective as possible, as profitable as possible, because we can only be profitable as a business if the people that are collaborating with us are being effective. And so know that everything that we do here is to support you and to see you become successful. Okay, so that's a bit of background on us and the business. Uh, very briefly, we pay cognizance to the circumstance that we find ourselves in. Uh, people have taken time out of their day on a Wednesday to come to head office here in Bryanston. We've got people that are taking time maybe over their lunch to watch this presentation because pretty much of the economy and the circumstance that we find ourselves in. So South Africans are generally heavily indebted. Uh, we have cost of living that is increasing uh, by the rate of inflation. Uh, that typically exceeds what our salaries are increasing by. So you all know that. You can ask yourself the question, well, have I received a 5, 6, 7% increase in my salary for the last 6, 7 years? If you haven't, your salary is actually devalued against what it was 5, 6, 7 years ago. And this is what a lot of South Africans, this is the circumstance that a lot of uh, us are finding ourselves in. We try to remedy the situation using debt. Debt doesn't fix the problem. Debt just sinks you deeper into the debt cycle and then it comes to a head when you get to retirement because while you're in employment, the 40, 45 years that you spend working for somebody else, at the same time you need to be creating a retirement fund right, so that you can have a dignified retirement when you get there. Um, unfortunately, the statistics that we get show that 
the majority of South Africans, when I say majority, I'm talking like over 95% of South Africans don't do enough for their retirement planning. Uh, and we're faced with that reality, that decision that we need to make. Well, now I need to downgrade my lifestyle. I need to get used to living on half the income that I was getting while I was employed. I have to depend on family members. I become a financial burden to my children. And that's really what we want to change. We want to change that prospect for the people in this business. So, out of all of that negativity, uh, Constantia saw the opportunity to create a platform um, that the average South African can engage in to change that circumstance. So, Dewpoint was launched two years ago. Uh, we have this system called the Dewpoint system that you can engage in. We have particular aspirations for people in this business that go beyond just creating extra cash for yourselves. Um, and those aspirations are to become debt-free. I would love to see everybody that uh, gets in, becomes engaged in this business to aspire to becoming debt-free. Because what that does is it empowers you to create wealth. And that's really what you want to do here, right? You here, you want to create wealth. You don't just want to meet your costs at the end of the month. You want to go beyond that. And you will go beyond that. If you meet costs and you keep building up this business, you'll go beyond that. And that's in terms of buying assets, uh, creating investments that appreciate. Um, and then ultimately, the, our third aspiration that we speak about is just changing your circumstance to be happier. Right? We, you here in hope that you will change your circumstance to be happier. Um, and that's through creating additional income. So unfortunately, money does solve a lot of our problems. Um, and that's what we plan to do here. So as guests, you have the opportunity to join Dewpoint. Uh, what happens in that process is that you actually contract with Dewpoint. Once you've contracted with us, we call you wealth engineers. And as wealth engineers, you're tasked with one single thing, and that is to build a channel of distribution. So I'll show you what a channel of distribution looks like. But basically, it's you going out and introducing more people to Dewpoint. And our online platform will facilitate the sale of products to those people that you introduce to us. And that's pretty much how this business works. The benefit for you is that you get to create an additional income stream for yourself. The nature of the income that you produce, though, is recurring or passive income. So this is a great benefit uh, that you get to share in uh, with an insurance company. So insurance companies typically have what we call book values. The book value has an intrinsic asset value that actually creates recurring income. So not all industries or um, uh, jobs or even businesses create recurring income. So the company I ran for 15 years didn't create any recurring income. That was a problem for me because I realized after about a decade that I would have to carry on working forever to keep producing the income. There was, I could never create an asset that would pay me into the future whether I worked or not. Right? So our salaries are also what we call active income. When, you're, when your job stops, when you get to retirement, your income stops. And so what the benefit speaks to is about creating passive income because this business will pay you beyond retirement. You can disappear, and we've shown it. If you look at uh, Tim's presentation at our awards evening two weekends ago, he brought up specific case studies in this business of wealth engineers that engaged in this business, had some success in the business, and then walked away. For who knows what reason, but they walked away, and they are still earning money from this business, even though they haven't looked at our business in over a year. Right? That's the ability to create recurring and passive income. Power duplication. So the system, the Dewpoint system, allows you to leverage. This is the ability to clone yourself, in a way, to duplicate yourself, right? So your success in this business is certainly not predicated on your single ability uh, to operate and build this channel of distribution. You can bring other people into the business and collaborate with them, thereby multiplying yourself, right? So we all have limited time. We trust that. Um, at least you have the ability to now leverage yourself. So if you only have one hour a day, but you've got a team of 20 people doing one hour a day, now you've got 21 hours a day being invested into your channel of distribution. In turn, increasing your recurring income. So those two benefits, recurring income, power duplication, are your ability to free yourself of time constraint. Right? Flexi time, so you get to choose when you want to do this business. You can do it at any time you want. You can do it for five minutes a day. You can do it for an hour a day. You can do it full time. You can do it on the weekends. You can do it at night. Completely up to you what that looks like. No startup capital. We don't have registration fees to become a wealth engineer. We don't have boxes of product that you have to invest in to get going in this business. right? We try and make this business as risk-free as possible so that it becomes more accessible to the average South African. There's no qualifications or experience required, so I trust no one brought their CVs with them today. right? We don't care about CVs. We care about work ethic. 
That's all we care about. I don't care what background you're from, whether you've got corporate experience, whether you've got matric, whether you've got a university. It doesn't matter to me. Right? It doesn't matter to us. You can be successful in this business regardless of who you are, where you're from, and what your circumstance is. Build an asset. Probably the most important benefit on the slide. Because we proposing, I'm proposing to you that you sacrifice time to build this channel of distribution, to build this business. Right? You're going to have to take time away from watching TV, relaxing, time with family. You're going to have to make time for Dewpoint to be successful. But know that the time you're investing into building this channel of distribution, you have legal tender over the channel of distribution that you're building. It means that you own this thing. You have ownership over this asset. Right? This sets us apart from employment. In employment, you're building someone else's asset. At Dewpoint, you're building your own asset. And that's why I say it will keep paying you beyond retirement. You don't surrender this asset that you're building at any stage unless you want to sell it. So you have the power to sell your business one day. You can seed it onto your kids one day, to your beneficiaries. It becomes part of your estate as a normal asset would. So I'm hoping you'll be happy to sacrifice time into building a channel of distribution. The nature, or sorry, there's no selling, so we actually contract you out of selling. So our contract with you says you're not allowed to sell or advise anyone on our products. That's a great thing. Who likes selling on the weekends? Right? That's not fun. I don't want to have to convince somebody or my friends, family, colleagues to buy something. Right? All you're tasked with is going out and connecting people to this opportunity. So if I go up to two groups of people, one group of people will say, oh, I've got some insurance products for you. Who's interested? Or if I go up to another group and say, oh, I've got a business opportunity where you can create additional income that's recurring, which group do you think I'm going to have success with? The latter, right? Because income opportunity is the number one commodity in South Africa at the moment. People are desperate to be connected with a business like this. And that's all you're tasked to do. The nature of our products are intangible. That means we have financial products. They're not tangible products. Like I said, we don't have boxes of product that you have to invest in to get started in this business. Right? That's a great benefit. Because it doesn't take up space at home. It doesn't expire. And so we make the products as convenient as possible for the average South African to get started in. But your success in our business is very much dependent on your ability to build a channel of distribution. So I said I was going to show you what it looks like. It begins with you. Picture yourself as the CEO of your new asset that you've now decided to build. And you, like I said, are going to go out and you're going to find people uh, that would be interested in this business. All you're going to do is connect them to this opportunity. And I will do the rest of the work like I'm doing now. You just get people to spend an hour. We've got a 15-minute presentation on YouTube, so we cater to 15 minutes. One hour, 45 minutes, doesn't matter. You find out how much time that person has, sit them down in front of the presentation. Brendan and myself will do the proposition of the business. If you are successful in that endeavor, and you get, in this example, five people to join your business, right? To join Dewpoint, they become wealth engineers in their own right, and they build their own channels in their own right. This is where the duplication takes place. Because these people are now building their channels. In turn, they're building your channel. This is where the leverage happens, right? Over time, this is what your channel could look. If you go look at Tim's presentation again from two weeks ago, the case studies of wealth engineers that have been in this business, he shows you how these channels explode. They explode. That's why the one woman who left, she's still earning today even though she hasn't stepped foot in dew point for a year. Still earning today. But she's lost a lot of money because she's got this massive channel beneath her that she's not leveraging properly. She's still earning, but she could leverage it a lot more, right? And so my hope is that you will build a channel that is sustainable. But what I mean by sustainable is a quality business because you want to bring people that you depend on, uh, that are dependable, people that uh, will thrive in a business like this, people that have the resources to thrive, people at your peer level that you can relate to and work with. And if you build a sustainable channel, it means you'll be closer and you'll get to that point faster where you can walk away from traditional employment. You'll have the luxury of being able to have this asset that's paying you every single month that you can rely on. And you know that you're going to walk away from it. You can take a two-month holiday, a three-month holiday, and know Dewpoint's going to pay you every month anyway. When in employment do we get to take a three-month holiday? If ever. If ever. Maybe once you're retrenched or once you're retired, then you can take a three-month holiday, right? But that prospect is never realistic if you're employment. It isn't. Unless you may be the CEO, right? You know the CEOs and the big execs, they get told, oh, you work for five years, you get given three-month holiday. But for the majority of us, we never have that prospect on the cards, right? So that's my hope for you. This is what a channel of distribution looks like. 
You'll be warned though, so we put up a warning slide. This is our disclaimer slide. Some people who arrive presentation like this thinking uh, that we are likened to one of these other network marketing businesses, these schemes that are running around the country, not one of those. We're a 70 year old insurance company, very reputable in the market. There are only about a dozen insurance companies in South Africa, right? We are a full blown tier one insurance company. People like King Price, Prime Meridian, those aren't insurance companies. They are being underwritten by insurance companies like ourselves. Right? So you need to make that distinction. We are listed on Jobex Stock Exchange. We wouldn't risk our business by trying to promote some form of scheme. At the same time, we never promise success quickly or easily. We invite people to engage in an entrepreneurial opportunity, and it takes hard work. Right? That's why we've got the picture of the ballerina's feet. Because we romanticize the notion of entrepreneurship. <coughs> when you go to the ballet, you see that pretty foot there. And you say, oh, it's so beautiful. Look at the ballerinas jumping around on stage. But if you take the ballet pump off, that's what the foot looks like underneath. And this is what business looks like. This is a great analogy for business. Right? You want to be a successful entrepreneur? Your friends will see that. But behind the scenes, it's blood, sweat, and tears. And that's what I invite you to engage in. Do you have what it takes to be successful? in this business okay so like any other insurance company we have products um, like any traditional insurance company what sets us apart from other companies is that we don't employ traditional forms of marketing in our business so the three products we've got three products their benefit is all financial in nature uh, you are free to consider one two or three products so it's completely up to you this is a purely personal decision on your behalf our first product is called access wealth um, it is our investment product, right? So it's 324 Rand a month, of which 100 Rand will get invested into a tax free investment fund in your name. It's a no notice investment. That means you can draw the money out with zero notice, right? It takes us about five working days to process that transaction, but you don't have to give us 30 or 60 days notice to draw your investment out. And you get a little bit of insurance with this product. So you have the investment, but you also have 120,000 Rand's worth of personal accident cover. So if you have this investment and you are killed in a car accident, for example, we'll pay out your beneficiaries 120,000 Rand plus whatever's in that investment. Okay. So this is Access Wealth, the first product. The second product is Wealth Guard. Now, Wealth Guard is only insurance. No investment yet. It's purely insurance. It's 299 Rand a month. But this time you get 1.2 million Rand's worth of personal accident cover. So if you're killed in that same car accident and you own this product, you get paid out or your beneficiaries get paid out 1.2 million Rand. Now note that I say it's personal accident cover. I'm not saying it's life insurance, not funeral cover. So don't make that mistake. The beauty of this product is that we don't profile your health risk to us, right? So those other products will profile your risk. Uh, this product doesn't. So that means I can offer this product to everybody over the age of 18. Right? You'd be hard pressed to find a product from any insurer that is only personal accident cover. It's actually quite difficult to find a product like this. Um, so you can be diabetic, you can be 75 years old, you can have cancer, you can have heart conditions. I can still offer you this product without change to the premium for the full 1.2 million rands worth of cover. Okay, so this is Wealth Guard, our insurance product, product number two. Product number three is called Wealth Points. Um, Wealth Points is 299 rand a month, and what this product aims to do is to save us money on the money that we spend every month anyway. So if you look at the list of partners that we have here, so these are companies that we've approached, we've negotiated discounts with them that we pass on to our Wealth Points members. So we've pretty much got everything covered. We've got groceries, we've got online retailers, we've got data, we've got car manufacturers, we've got entertainment. We've pretty much covered every scope of spending that we do uh, on a monthly basis. So if you're part of the Wealth Points, you get to engage in the discounts that they offer. So for example, Always On Wi-Fi data is a great example because they give us a massive discount. If you go to Always On and you ask them for one gig of data, they typically charge 100 Rand for a gig of data. Right? But to our Wealth Points members, you get it for 37 Rand. You see the discount there? Right? So the discounts are different with every partner. And we are adding new partners to this program all the time. So we've just announced a brand new uh, Wealth Points partner this month, literally this week. Uh, so Jaguar Land Rover, Santon, has come on board. Uh, they have promised to give us the best service and the best prices on uh, pre-owned and new Jaguar Land Rover. So if anyone's about to buy a Range Rover, anyone about to buy a Range Rover, right? These are the people you're going to go to soon, soon, right? I've got my eye on that Range Rover Velar. A couple of people in my complex driving around in those. Very fancy. Okay. 
So we are always adding new partners to the Wealth Points program. If you want immediate benefit, it's a great product to have. All right, so basically just to explain again the difference between us and traditional companies, so it just allows you to understand our business model a little uh, more. Traditional companies uh, spend a lot of money on marketing and advertising. That's simply how most companies market themselves, right? They spend money on advertising through various marketing channels. At Dewpoint, we don't spend a cent on advertising. So you won't see a Dewpoint logo outside our building. You will only see it on perhaps on someone's business card, uh, on the website, maybe on YouTube, and that's it. Um, and that means we don't have to spend the billions that typical insurance uh, companies spend on advertising every year. We can take that portion of our budget. So it's just us moving our budget from advertising into the network marketing space. And so we can pay that money to our wealth engineers for helping us grow our business. And that's basically how our business model works, right? So very simply. All right, so there are two ways to earn money in this business um, or to benefit out of our business. One is through the recurring income that you generate. So we call that our returns program. The returns program is your ability to make recurring income. It is your primary, your number one focus in this business. The second way is through our rewards program, and I'll show you the rewards program a little later. But the returns program works like this. We pay a base return fee of 27.50 for every product that ends up in your channel, right? But that is dependent on where the product lies in relation to you. So remember the first five individuals you introduced to the business? That product, those people, those product owners, lie on your first point. They're one point away from you. And on the table, you can see we pay you 55 rand. So we pay you the double, the 27 rand 50, for every product. And remember, it's recurring income. So it's every month you get that 55 rand for every product. And then as your channel starts to grow, because these five people are going to go out, and start referring other people to the business. That product is also in your channel, but it's on your second point. And on your second point, again, you get paid 55 Rand for every product every single month. And then your channel is going to keep growing and keep growing. And in this example, we've got it all the way down to point eight. So you see the multiplier starts to drop all the way to point eight. So as the product gets further and further away from you, the less it is. At point eight, it's 4%. But what is important to note here, you see it's got a little plus there. It means from point 0.8 onwards into infinity, we will keep paying you the 4%. To infinity, in theory. We don't limit you on how big your channel can get. We've got wealth engineers of point 0.30 already in their businesses in 24 months. Right? We don't limit you on how big your channel can get. We don't limit you on how much money you can earn at point. Okay, so this is the mechanics of the returns. Fairly straightforward. How much money can you earn, though, in this business over time? So we asked our que the question to ourselves. We said, okay, let's build a projection. So let's show people what they could possibly do over the next five years in this business. We call it the path to success. It is based on a premise. So the premise is a growth formula. It says, if a new wealth engineer can come into our business and in the first month bring three people onto their first point, and then every consecutive month thereafter, so in March they bring in another two, April another two, May another two, and they keep bringing two people every month. We call it the 3 plus 2 growth formula. If you can follow that formula, after six months, you'll be around 2,500 rand. Right? So most people would look at 2,500 rand, like I did when I first saw the example. I said, who's going to join six months of work for 2,500 rand? Is that worth it? I didn't think so. Maybe I've given you my lesson before. right? But I've learned over time. I've learned. So one of the things we want to achieve in this business is to make people think differently about money. I don't just want to put money in your hand every month. I want you to start thinking differently about money so we don't make the same mistakes we made in the past. So my lesson here at month six, looking at that two and a half thousand rand. If you think like a consumer spender, you can quite easily look at two and a half thousand rand and go, it's not a lot of money. For six months worth of work, is it worth my time? The time I'm sacrificing with family? Maybe not. Right? But I want to change your perception of the value of money. So, I'll put an example of someone who has got debt, because I know we all have debt. Right? We all have debt. If you've got a bond, it's big debt. Right? Long-term debt. Because most of us, when we get a bond, we enter into a bond contract that's got a term of 20 years. 20 years, you're paying back the bank. On this example, a million rand bond, at prime plus two, you're paying back 11,500 rand a month for 20 years. So, if you're 40... You get to make your last installment when you're 60, right? It's like a lifetime of debt that you pretty much engage in when you have a bond. So you might be thinking, okay, I've engaged in the bond now. I've got a million rand debt. I'm going to pay the house off. That's great. I've got a house. You join Dewpoint. Six months later, you're earning two and a half thousand rand. And instead of spending that money, you listen to Rob, 
who said, pay your debt off as quickly as possible. Let that be one of your aspirations. So instead of spending the money, you decide, okay, I'll put the 2,500 Rand as an additional payment into my bond. What is the net effect of that? What benefit do I have of paying my bond off just a little bit faster? Right? Because 2,500 Rand, what's that, like 20% of the 11,500 you're paying every month? It nearly halves the term of your bond. You can pay that bond off in 11,500 years instead of 20 years. Right? That's how quickly you'll pay the bond off. Nearly half the time just with 20% extra going into the bond. How much money does that save you? That's the big question. It saves you nearly 1 million rand in interest repayments you would have made. The bank would have charged you an extra million rand just for taking an extra 8.5 years to pay your bond off. Right? That's how much money you save by paying it off sooner. At the 12-month mark, you're earning in excess of 100,000 rand annually. Who got a 100,000 rand bonus this year? from the employers huh no that's just a dream right maybe if you're a trader or you're a top exec or a top salesman you get that type of money 12 months time 100,000 rand check you can take 100,000 rand home every Christmas as a check additional to your income so now I'm hoping you're a little more interested right it's a little better than the two and a half thousand rand at month 24 after two years you could be earning nearly 30,000 rand a month okay now we're talking notable cash at the 36-month mark, you're earning nearly 50,000 rand a month. See how quickly it accelerated? Because your effort in this business is not based on your effort alone. If you want to be successful in this business, you have to leverage. You have to duplicate yourself. Effectively. Not ineffectively, right? Effectively. Here we've got a bond example of 5 million rand bond. If you take that 36,000 rand that you're earning at month 30 and you put it into your bond, you'll pay a 5 million rand house off in 7 years. I should actually calculate how much money that saves you in interest. But I suspect paying it off in that amount of time, you're probably going to save yourself at least 5 million rand in interest. Because typically a 20-year bond, you're paying back about 2.5 times the value of the asset. Right? So you bought a 5 million rand house, it actually cost you 12.5 million you financed it right get rid of that finance as quickly as possible you keep going after 48 months you're close to 70,000 rand a month and after 60 months five years away you're making for yourself about a million rand in annual recurring income think about what you were doing five years ago probably the same thing you're doing now right earning the same if not less because of inflation five years is not a long time Remember, it's based on this growth formula, assuming that you can bring two people into the business every single month for 60 months in a row, and you duplicate properly. And we've taken into consideration all the negative aspects of our business, people that don't pay their products, people that don't build. We've taken that into consideration. You'll still get to a million rand after 60 months. But it's purely academic. It's an example the accountants came up with, right? So it's a bit clinical. But fortunately, I've got proof in the flesh. We've got wealth engineers that we invite up onto stage all the time that have been here for two years, some have been here a year, sometimes if they've been here for six months, we bring them in, put them on stage and ask them to tell their story. So here we've got Natasha Weldrick, she's from PE. Um, she joined a year ago, just more than a year ago. And let's see what's notable about her growth as a wealth engineer. So she's on a recurring income of 10,000 Rand a month, right? So she, you could say she's tracking three plus two quite nicely and she's duplicating in her business um, in her second month though I mean she came out like a firecracker when she started in her second month she was on two and a half thousand rand on her third month she was at three thousand eight hundred rand a month right so she had very quick success in the business last month alone so here is an illustration of leverage last month alone her channel grew by nearly a hundred people do you see the leverage do you see the ability if you can duplicate yourself how big your channel imagine sitting back and your channel just grew by 100 people every single month all right that's what her channel's doing at the moment in her first 42 days she brought in 23 people new wealth engineers on her first point so she must have spoken to at least 50 to 100 people in the first 60 days of the business right. yeah we got ray and rumbi uh they joined in april so they've been around for about 10 months um they at just over 10,000 rand a month, so they are doing more than 3 plus 2. They conquered the most wealth quests, so we've got these short-term incentives called wealth quests. 
they are on their fourth wealth quest. So they've got iPhones, iPads, TVs, and data that they've earned from us. Oh, and last month they got 10,000 Rand check on top of their recurring income. Right? Their channel also grew by 100 alone in January, and they are averaging 12 apps a month. 12 apps a month. So they're not doing 3 plus 2, they're doing 3 plus 12. Plus 12, plus 12, plus 12, plus 12, plus 12. Right? And I think Ray already drives a Range Rover. So you've got to understand, this business motivates all kinds of people. Right? Someone like Natasha, who's a single mother of three, is motivated very differently to what Ray and Rumbi are. Right? You've got to decide what motivates you in this business. You've got to decide what you want out of the business. He has Shadrach. Uh, I guess I could call him a politician. He's a councillor, mayor in Newcastle. Um, also joined in April. But whew, this man is busy. So 12,000 Rand monthly return um, already. 213. He got 213 people to join his first point. So this is his personal activity in 10 months. 33 apps. Last month he did 33 people to join. He must have spoken to 100 people last month to get 33 to say, yes, I want to become a wealth engineer. And he's conquered three wealth quests. Everybody is different. We've got thousands of wealth engineers joining this business every single month. Everyone creating different recurring income for themselves. Everyone running at a different pace in the business. That's why I say it's important for you to understand what your goal is in the business and then to work towards that goal. If you want to do 30 apps a month, do 30 apps. If you're happy just with 3 plus 2, you do 3 plus 2. We've all got different circumstances, different motivation. Decide what you want out of the business. Right? So this is our returns program. This is the ability to create recurring income. What is the decision? The decision is, I've put this on the table for you, right? So I like to picture it like a table. There's the recurring income. It's waiting for you on the table. The decision for me is, are you willing to work for it? Because it's available. The opportunity is exactly the same for every single person. You need to decide what you want off the table. 10,000 a month, a million rand a year, what is it? But the question you have to face with, or you've got to ask yourself, is am I willing to do the work? Remember the ballerinas, bloody foot, missing toenails, right? Didn't look very nice. Not pretty, right? That's what you've got to ask yourself. Am I willing to put myself through that to get what's on the table? So for me, very straightforward decision. Read our code of conduct. It defines what you can and cannot do as a wealth engineer. So that's foremost. You need to understand the code of conduct. Register as a wealth engineer, very simply. On our website, you click on that big, big blue apply button. It takes you about seven minutes to become a wealth engineer. But that's only the start. You need to check our online training out. We've got about seven videos that make up our basic series. Go watch those videos. It's so important to understand what this business is. You might think, oh, no, I understand this business. I've done it before. You haven't done this business before. This is a unique business, right? So engage in that training. Become a professional in Dewpoint. Set goals for yourself. That's why I said, decide what you want on the table. Set the goals, prepare the plan to get there, and keep yourself accountable to the plan. That's why we set goals, so we can measure ourselves whether we're being successful or not. If you don't set the goal, then you don't know whether you're being successful or not, because you just kind of float in the water, right? And then start talking to people. So if you're like Shadrach, you speak to three people a day. Task yourself. Your plan will define how many people you need to speak to. Is it one person a day? Is it a couple of people a week? But this business is built on speaking to people. If you're not speaking to people, you're not doing the business. Very straightforward. To help you along, we've got merchandise. Please consider getting business cards. For me, this is foremost. I cannot imagine anyone proposing business without business cards. It just becomes part of that professional package. Right? This business is very much built on credibility and first impressions. That's why at the beginning of our presentation, we talk all about credibility. Right? If you came to my business and I was working out of a little four square meter apartment and uh, our entire remuneration plan was run off an Excel spreadsheet and I didn't have business cards, would you take me seriously? No. Right? This is part of looking professional. Please consider getting the business cards. Memory sticks, we've got all the videos on. The pins represent people that are earning. If you're not earning in our business, you can't buy a pin, right? So get a pin. The moment you qualify in our business, you get yourself a pin. We've got power banks, notebooks. Everything's in the merchandise uh, section over there across from the counter. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. 500 videos on there. Wealth and knowledge just waiting for you. Download our mobile app onto your smartphone. This becomes your primary tool of business because our mobile app reflects in real time what is happening in your business. 
It tells you every single detail. Who's who? Who's paying? Who's joined? Who's lapsed? Who's cancelled? Everything is told to you. It tells you if you're making money while you're sleeping. Right? When you wake up in the morning, you want to be like Natasha and like Ray and Rumi where you see your channel grew overnight. Right? That means your recurring income went up overnight. So make sure you get the, download the mobile app as quickly as possible. Some don'ts that we need to highlight. If you don't have the resources in this business to thrive and do dew point, the business is not for you. We do not target this business to unemployed people. The business is not designed to burden the burdened. We are trying to empower people that have resources. Not a lot of resources. Like I said, we make this business as risk-free as possible, but that's the segment that we target it to. So if you can't afford one of the products, the business is not for you. If you don't have access or you can't afford data, you're going to really struggle in this business. If you don't have access to transport, you're going to struggle in this business. Because when you go out and start building this business, it's about relationship. You're bringing people onto your first point that you're going to develop relationships with, right? It requires some transport. Don't ever complete a point application form on behalf of somebody else. That is fraudulent, right? So black and white. It's illegal. You can't write down someone's details and then go do their application for them late at night because they don't have a smartphone phone or they don't have email, right? Can't do that. Illegal, please. Uh, don't add direct family members that live in your household into your channel. So you can't. If you've got family members that are living with you, they can't be in your channel. They can be in someone else's channel, no problem, but they can't be in your channel. If you've got family members that have left home, they can be in your channel, right? Do we understand that rule? Um, don't start your own Dewpoint Facebook page. This is also illegal. You're breaking financial services board regulation. You cannot promote, publicize, or advertise Dewpoint, our subsidiaries, our products, our third parties in any way. In any way, right? This is our biggest. Do you know how many people start Facebook pages? It is crazy to me, right? Every single day we've got someone starting a Facebook page. Dewpoint Johannesburg, Dewpoint International. Dew point products. It's ridiculous. I mean, it's almost laughable, but we've got to deal with this because it poses regulatory risk to us. The regulator comes to us and says, what are these people doing? Right? So we've got a contracted company that looks for people, and it's easy to find online. You type in dew point, the whole list comes up of everybody, and we suspend all those wealth engineers immediately, and then you can't do business as a wealth engineer. Um, you, please don't send leads. So what this point actually, I need to rewrite that point. The last point, the final point there, speaks to the professional behavior that you need to have as a dew point wealth engineer. You can't go prospect people on Facebook and send them to head office unattended. That's how the problem arose. We had people coming into our head office going, oh no, this guy Bob, I uh, met him on Facebook. He sent me to head office. He said, Rob or Brendan will take care of me. Right? That's not the way to build your business. Right? My job is up on the stage here to support you, not to do your work for you. So treat these people with dignity and be professional, always. Okay, so this is the wealth quest. This is the challenge. I told you Ray and Rumbi, uh, they got to four wealth quests last year. Um, so February's wealth quest, so every month is different. February is called the Triple Lightning Qualifier. The challenge is to bring three new people into your business in the month of January, uh, month of February and to qualify each of those people. So qualify means they need to find three people each. Of themselves. So in total, you'll have 12 new wealth engineers in your business in February. Everyone will pay their products successfully. And if you do that, you can choose between an iPhone 5S, an iPad, a 49-inch smart LED TV. Uh, by the 15th of March, you'll get to choose that as your reward for hard work over February. On the 1st of March, you'll see a new wealth quest come out, right? So I'm hoping this gets you started with a little bit of fire under your behinds. All right, so I said there was two ways to earn as wealth engineers. We spoke about the returns program. There's a second way, our XP rewards program. So the XP rewards program works like this. As a new wealth engineer, if you do typical wealth engineer things, you're going to be coming to presentations. You're going to be bring, bringing guests with you. You might do home presentations. Uh, you're going to be logging into the app. And when you do all these things, you earn what we call XP, experience points. And when you start collecting more and more experience points and your business, your channel starts to grow, that is being successful, right? And we reward you for the success that you have in our business. So if you start out today, you'll start out as a rank zero wealth engineer, but in two minutes, you can earn 1,000 XP in our business. You need four products in your qualified channel, and when you meet those two criteria, we give you a once-off 55 rand reward. The rewards program is not a recurring thing. These are once-offs, right? Once-off 55 rand. But as you start collecting more XP and your channel starts to grow, the rewards get bigger. 
right? There's a 20,000 rand, a 50,000 rand check waiting for you in the rewards program. We give tools to our wealth engineers to help them build their channels more effectively. So at rank five, all our rank fives get this fancy little uh, memory stick. It's got all our videos on there, and you can plug it into any device. It plugs into cell phones, tablets, computers, TVs, laptops. So Patrick and Pumi can show people the opportunity regardless of what device they have around them. At rank seven, we spend 12 and a half thousand rand on a set of single business cards for you. Business cards with your name on it in gold. Right? Can you see? It looks like a block of gold, those business cards. Go take a look at them in the merchandise cabinet. Because this business is about first impressions and credibility. Right? If you've got some shabby business cards, people aren't going to take you seriously. If you've got 12,500 rand business cards, I promise you, when you put one of those babies on the table, people are impressed. They are. Go speak to any of the wealth engineers that have got these cards. They let people feel them. They don't give them away. Just, you look at my card. I want it back. I'm putting it in my back pocket. They're too valuable to give away. Right? And rank nine, this is actually the first recurring reward in our rewards program. So recurring, I mean this happens every year. For our rank nines and above, we take them to our international conference every single year in December. So it is seven days away to a five-star luxury resort. We fly you and your family business class every year for the rest of your life. Rank nine. Right, everyone gets excited about this one. We're going to talk about it afterwards. So take a look at our last the rank nine trip. Everyone is welcome. Up to you. The next 10 months. Get to make it happen for yourself. All of your wind has gone and all of the path you've drawn have sunk to the where no one can see You stand all at the dark Embrace, cower the dreams You chase under the rust And blood, don't let yourself be there every year for the rest of your life with your kids right that's another thing on the table half our wealth engineers got there in less than a year to rank nine one individual got there in five months he saw the presentation for the first time ever heard about dew point for the first time ever five months later rank nine it's up to all of you. everyone's different i'm just telling you records are made to be broken right 
you've got nine, ten months to get to our next rank nine trip. If you don't make it, it doesn't matter. We don't reset you to zero. You've still got time to make next year's trip. If you don't make next year's trip, you make the following year's trip, right? If it takes you three years to get to rank nine, so what? You're going to be going to rank nine trip for the rest of your life. At rank 11, we spend a quarter of a million rand on a brand new car. We give it to our wealth engineers. No T's and C's. You don't share it with another wealth engineer. We don't put a big dew point sticker on the side of the car. It is your car. We pay cash for it. We put it in your name. You drive it off our parking lot. So that's rank 11. This is what our rewards program looks like. It goes up to rank 28. Rank 11. You don't believe me, but this is early days. Early days, right? When we start getting to rank 20-something, then you know you've been in the business for about 10 years. Okay. So this is the start to the rewards program. Guys, I invite you, 2018, to get stuck into this business. I will do everything to support you in this business. Make it count for yourselves. Like I said, I can't force you to come look at what's on the table. You can see what's on the table. I'm inviting you to come take what you want off of it. You want an iPad, you want an iPhone, you want recurring income, you want a rank nine holiday, you want a car, it's on the table for everybody. <coughs> You've got to make that decision as to whether it's worthwhile for your time to engage in it. So I thank you for your time. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your Friday, a great weekend, an even better 2018. If you have any questions, come speak to me. Thanks so much. <laughs>